I'm sure as many of you know, the App Store is no longer loading, no longer loads on iOS 5 or 6. It just pops up with that error. However, as a big shock to everybody, there is a jailbreak tweak to fix it. So let's get into it. So the only thing requirement for this method besides your iOS device running iOS 5 or 6 is that you need to be jailbroken for this to work. And if, you, and if you're unsure how to jailbreak iOS 5 and 6, I'll link tutorials to it in the description. As you can tell, I've already done this on my iOS 5 iPhone 4S and my iOS 6 iPhone 4. So now let's set those two phones aside and let's get out my iOS 6 iPhone 5 where we will be installing some more apps onto. So what you need to do first is go into Cydia, wait for it to load, go into edit, add, and you want to add in this repo called Cydia.akemi, Akemi, if I can type, .ai. And so once you do that, then you can just go ahead and wait for the source to install, which shouldn't take too long. Then there you go. Now you go into Karen's repo. Please don't make... Please don't make any jokes about the de this developer's name because she's a very hardworking developer. So we want to install AppSync Unified. Hit install, confirm, and there you go. Just like that, it is installed, installing, and it will give you this note. Just hit, okay, I understand, restart Springboard. Wait for it to respring. Okay, there we go. Now, once you're done with that, you need to go into Cydia. Wait for it to finish loading. Go into sections, sort or sources, excuse me, add, add and you want to add in this repo called one pwn. If I can type on this little tiny keyboard, dot xmo dot com slash dev, and you want to add the source. And then just like that, you are good to go. Or not quite good to go yet as you've only installed the repo. Now you need to go into all packages and you need to install Vit Viteris. Install, hit confirm. And just like that, we'll go ahead and start installing Viteris for you. And once you go to return to Cydia, as you can tell, just like this, there will be a new, f a new application on your home screen known as Viteris. So once you're done with that, you can just go ahead and Open up Viteris to install an app. You go into an application that you know works, like for example, let's go into Pac-Man right here. Note that I forgot to add when I initially recorded this video is that if you try to search up an application into the search function, Viteris currently does not work. So you'll just have to manually find applications by category or something. Let's go into and head and download it, and I'll be back to you once Pac-Man is done downloading. The app is finished installing, you'll get a notification saying success application finished installing. And just like this, you should be able to play Pac-Man, for example. So that is how you install apps on iOS 5 through 6 in 2023. And did you like this video? If you, if you did, please like this video and please share this video with your friends. And please tell me if it helped, comment down below if it helped. As always, I'm the iTunes fanboy. Thanks for watching this video, and as always, peace out.